Hey guys, Kev here. Um, I'm getting word that there's going to be some type of mass shooting again, the biggest one maybe in American history. And it's going to be aimed at blacks. Um, because of the uh, recent um, fraud that going on, the election fraud, uh, in Arizona, Pennsylvania, etc., and this COVID bullshit lies going on. People are waking up and people are investigating and finding out that they're being lied to. So, what they're going to do is the word is that the government's going to do some type of attack to divert people and to get to try to further divide people up. So, what I'm hearing is that they're going to have. I don't want to say Proud Boys, they're going to blame it on them or militia or right-wingers or Trump supporters, whatever. And this time they're going to use like five, six, eight, ten gunmen going into a black event, church, something. I don't know. And I don't even like talking about this kind of stuff. I'm just telling you what my feeling is and what I'm hearing. So... And I hate doing it because I don't like telling people, well, you know, don't go here, don't do this, you know, live your life. But just at the same time, be aware of your surroundings in these next few days to weeks, you know, because it is the 4th of July uh, weekend coming up. So what I'm hearing is that's what's going to happen. They're going to go in and, and kill 100, 200, 300 people. And then a government team is going to take those people out so that there's no... Uh, witnesses or no, no nobody who can talk from that group and say that they were, you know, whatever, set up or convinced to do this or brainwashed like in the Timothy McVeigh, um, Terry Nichols case with the Oklahoma City, city bombing because the government did that and were involved in that. They did, two guys did not do that alone. But anyway, I'm just telling you this just to document it. And like I said, I don't like talking about this kind of stuff and telling people this because I hope it doesn't happen, of course. So, but things I think are, they got to keep this divide going because they don't want people uniting and coming together and working together and figuring out that, that they're being lied to. I know that much. So anyway, hopefully, like I said, I'm wrong. I pray I'm wrong, but be aware, be aware. Peace.